Does diabetes really run in the family? Or is it a myth? Diabetes and genetics are often linked, but is it really that simple? Let's dive into the science. 30 to 40 years ago, there were very few diabetics in the same family, but now it's much more prominent. The human genome remains relatively unchanged for centuries, yet the rise in diabetes is recent. Genes don't change over generations, but over centuries. So, if genetics hasn't changed what has? The environment, both internal and external, has changed drastically. A family that eats, lives, and sleeps together develops the same health or diseases. This is the real meaning of runs in the family. Epigenetics. Epigenetics is influenced by our choices, the wrong foods like wheat, dairy, sugars, processed foods and simple carbs, blue light toxicity, poor water quality, lack of sunlight and outdoor activities, sedentary lifestyle, stress, poor quality sleep, and exposure to Wi-Fi and digital devices. So, should we still focus on genetics and family history? The answer is no. Instead, let's focus on lifestyle changes that can prevent and treat diabetes early. Prevent and treat diabetes by eating a balanced diet, staying active, managing stress, and getting quality sleep. Avoid processed foods and sugars, stay hydrated, and spend time outdoors. So, the next time someone says diabetes runs in the family, remember that it's not just about genetics. It's about the choices we make every day.